Hey, what's up guys? Brian here, Brian's Law Maintenance. All right, we're still at GIU Plus Expo and I got a special treat for you guys. For all of you guys that fertilize lawns and treat lawns, we're over here with none other than the man himself, Teddy, with Graham Spray Equipment. How you doing, brother? Doing great, man, and yourself? It's good seeing you. Good seeing you, Brian. How's the show been so far? It's been busy, it's been good. <laughs> it has been nuts, guys. It's been so much fun. So, uh, quick disclaimer, some sponsored content here. We're partnering up with Graham Spray Equipment. They got some uh, amazing equipment, a really nice rig here. Teddy's gonna walk us through uh, Graham Spray Equipment's story and then also the rig. And if you guys are into fertilizing, pay attention because this is a really cool setup. So, what do we got here, brother? Cool, guys. As he said, the, the story of Graham Spray Equipment, we're in our 42nd year. We do business nationwide. On this particular truck that we brought, we we're showcasing it for one of our franchises franchises that that does that and uh, so I'm gonna just walk you through it right quick absolutely obviously we're on the we're on the Isuzu cab and chassis uh, just most durable mid-size work truck ever we have a pass-through box here obviously everything we do at Graham is made out of aluminum as far as our beds and boxes for longevity we have an 800 gallon tank split 600 200 that's our lawn tank here in this particular side and then we have a separate 100 gallon tank in the back that uh, is a tree and shrub tank uh, so this truck set up to do about a half a million dollars a year of revenue wow mainly these trucks are commercial sized trucks uh, but obviously here at Graham we've got everything from the guy that's just starting out to to things like this. Now going to the uh, the Graham Spray Equipment startup story for a minute, because you guys have been around for what was the, how long? 42 years. So what was the story you guys getting started back in the day? Well, uh, Max Graham, yep. uh, he worked for, uh, at the time, Kim Lawn, okay. uh, as a research and development guy. And he felt back then that, uh, that he could build a better truck than what they were getting. So he started in his garage in Douglasville, Georgia, and he built uh, his first truck and that kind of parlayed into, uh, uh, he hooked up with a guy named Charlie Holloway who is a legend in this business, uh, who was at the time an engineer for Atlanta. Okay. And they built this thing into a uh, predominantly a Southeast region business, but we've grown now to, to we do nationwide stuff. So the configuration that we have on the truck, right? You said uh, 800 gallon tank with a six and two, That's right. um, but you can customize it almost any way, right? We are, we are the only true custom builder in the country. Wow. Uh, so yes, uh, uh, we have done all kinds of stuff. I have uh, about 11,000 pictures of, of wow. some amazing stuff. So not everybody has an NQR, NPR, right? So with the, the Isuzu, sometimes you can put them on a, a half ton, a three quarter ton. What, sure. what do you guys see with that? Uh, we have skid units in, uh, that, that will fit right up in the back of traditional beds. Okay. Uh, um, obviously in this industry, it's always easier to work uh, out of a flat bed of some sort. Sure. Uh, but, uh, and we can set up these setups on conventional cabs and chassis as long as it's the proper weight distribution, etc. Sure. So this uh, rig, one more time, if you want to take us through it, we got the different hoses and reels. So if somebody's maybe new to fur and they've never seen a rig that's nice and this kind of fancy, right? What do we got with the different hoses and the, the Hort tank in the back? Gotcha. Uh, the, the two reels, as you see, they're color coded. And this is for the 200 section. Uh, that may be here in the southeast for fescue grass, for example. Okay. Then this side here would uh, would be for Bermuda grass uh, in this. And then of course back here, this reel is for your tree and shrub care or plant health care. Absolutely, this is really cool. Now, one thing that I'm looking here is we're talking quality, mm -hmm. for sure. Like everything's stainless steel and aluminum. It looks really, really nice. Right. Um, I think that's something that really separates you guys from the competitors. I've used a lot of fur equipment right. in my day. Um, any other quick notable highlights? But we super appreciate the time, brother. Sure. Um, you know, you said quality, and that that is one thing at Graham that we refuse to 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 chintz on. Absolutely. Um, we are a little more expensive than most of our competitors, but it's because of the quality of product that we use. These are Hannay reels, for example. Yep. These are military grade reels that most of your fire departments and, and our military uses on things that require reels. Wow. Um, we use Honda motors. Uh, you know, obviously Honda is Honda, right? Yep. 
Um, Super reliable. AR pumps, our diaphragm pumps, they're the best in the world. So <laughs> that, that's what we pride ourselves on. Yeah. And I have no problem telling you that this rig, properly maintained, will last about 15 years. Wow, that's awesome. That's really cool. And where can they find more info for all this? Um, GrahamSC.com. That's the best resource. On right? the website? Yeah. Awesome. Well, guys, I really appreciate Teddy taking some time to show us uh, this rig. We actually did a podcast. Was it earlier this spring? Yep. Or maybe even last fall. I don't even remember. Earlier this spring. Earlier this spring. It's been a blur, but I really enjoyed your podcast. Uh, for real, we didn't just talk about Graham spray equipment. We're not here to give you a big pitch. Teddy shared for 50 minutes out of the hour episode that we did just talking about business and mindset and how to run a successful company you've been in the industry for 26 years right 20... now i own my own company for 17. that's right okay so the story is crazy he's got a lot of business experience he's not just trying to sell you a rig or a setup he knows how to make money with it too and that's the cool part absolutely i loved our podcast episode i still get people that binge listen to the podcast and uh, they're going through back through some old our episodes and it's that guy teddy he was really really nice and i'm not just saying that i mean that genuinely oh, I appreciate it. so Dude, all right guys do such a great job well thank you for making great product for these guys out there yeah bye right, brother hey thanks for the time thank you so much. all right guys well graham spray equipment make sure you guys check them out and uh we'll leave some links in the description down below but check it out and if you guys enjoyed the video big thumbs up we super appreciate it we'll see you guys in the next one